ERCP is an endoscopic procedure through which we address problems of the bile duct and also the pancreatic duct. People can have various bile duct issues such as uh, bile duct stones, a bile duct stricture, a tumor blocking the bile duct. And for this, we can do an ERCP and solve the problem either by removing a stone, possibly putting in a stent. ERCP is also used for pancreatic disorders in which we d deal with the problem very similarly, but we're not in the bile duct, but we're in the pancreatic duct. The indications for ERCP can roughly be broken down into biliary or pancreatic indications. The most common biliary indication far and away is management of common bile duct stones. Uh, ERCP is the most straightforward, uh, easiest way of managing stones in the common bile duct. A bile leak is another common indication. Bile leaks typically occur after gallbladder surgery, but can also occur after liver trauma. The purpose of an ERCP in a bile leak is to place a stent and redirect the bile from the leak back down into the duodenum. Biliary strictures are another common indication for ERCP. Strictures can be malignant, such as a cholangiocarcinoma or pancreatic cancer, or they can be benign, such as primary sclerosis and cholangitis, chronic pancreatitis, or post-transplant strictures. Sphincter valvular dysfunction is another less common indication for ERCP, but benign papillary stenosis uh, can be seen and is easily treated with ERCP and biliary sphincterotomy. As far as pancreatic indications, there are indications for management of chronic pancreatitis in patients with pancreatic duct strictures. Patients with pancreatic duct stones can also often be managed by ERCP. Patients with recurrent acute pancreatitis that can be traced to a biliary or pancreatic origin, in some cases may be well treated with ERCP. An example would be minor papillotomy to treat recurrent acute pancreatitis associated with pancreas divisum. Pancreatic duct leaks can be seen either postoperatively or after an episode of acute pancreatitis. Some leaks can create large fluid collections or even cutaneous fistulas, and placement of a pancreatic stent can correct this leak.